Hey everybody, Vaughman here, and I am going to do a kind of a quick break of the Topps Chrome Blasters and the infamous, very elusive uh, Panini Illusions. Um, these are the ones that the everybody is going crazy over at Walmart's, and it is just insane. I'm surprised nobody has gotten any crazy fist fights over these silly cards as of yet but um but yeah you guys have seen it probably yourselves in person or on other videos where people are just camping out um i had gone to get some stuff at uh, a walmart a few days ago and uh there was like five guys waiting for the card lady to uh to stack them and uh, of course it was funny because they were all wanting to get them for their their sons so i think the father son bonding over these cards is amazing um i have you know it's just comedy but uh i guess they can only bond when they buy two or three cases of these so anyways anyways guys we'll get to ripping and i hope you guys are having a great weekend we'll do the uh tops chrome first just uh since we're kind of familiar with these i never collect basketball so i don't really know a lot about them i know some of the players but i haven't really kept up with it as much as um, i used to i'm just waiting for the stadium club cards coming out next week i think it's next week so i'm hoping to get some of those and i wonder if they're going to be as crazy as the tops chrome and the basketball cards so Anyways, guys, here we go. Hope you guys are doing well. I videotaped the guys all waiting. There was like five of them waiting. And um, I uh, was going to put it on my video, but I do not know how to do that yet. So I haven't really got around to splicing and to editing my videos like I need to. But uh, here we go. We've got here Jesus Lazardo. Uh, D. Gordon. There's Chris Bryant, 85. A.J. Puck, Ricky. But you have to wonder when it's going to slow down or, you know, Walmart needs to take control of that. They need to have the managers put those in the back and just limit two or three. All right, Brandon McKay, rookie. Corey Kluber. Oh, we got a Nolan Ryan die cut. Good looking card. I really like the die cuts. I think they're kind of a cool. And Dan Vogelbach. He's all happy. And I think uh, Eric Jabs actually videotaped the guy. Just, I mean, he doesn't even let the poor lady uh, stalker just even open the boxes. I mean, he just immediately puts them in his cart like he's on some crazy shopping spree. All right, Jose Ercuti. Elvis Andres. And Michael Chavez, Future Stars. Those are good looking cards this year. I like those. It's kind of a little different. And there he is, Jordan Alvarez. Good looking card. Hopefully with school starting back, maybe it won't be as bad. Since uh, all these men, their kids are going back to school and they can just take them to school and won't have to worry about spending hours at Walmart waiting for a stalker lady or a man. David Peralta. Tommy Edmund. Michael Fulmer. And Carlos Santana. 
Alright, here we go. Matt Thesis. Thesis. Jean Segura. And Juan Soto. I think I pulled his last time I did a break. And Patrick Corbin. Alright. Here we go, Logan Webb, Logan Webb, rookie. And there's Fernando Tatis Jr. Gold Cup. Great looking card there. And we got Nick Solik, rookie. And Anthony K, rookie. All right. Last pack. For the regular all right here we got Aaron Savali Max Scherzer and we got Vladimir Guerrero Jr. the prism cup card and we have got Trey Turner Got some decent cards. Hopefully the the sepia, the bonus sepia here will turn something decent. All right. Oh, here we go. Another Fernando Tatis Jr. That's interesting. Another Aaron Savali. Liam Hendricks. And finally, Nick Senzel. All right, all right, now here we go, the hallowed illusions. It's like the, uh, the you've got the Holy Grail and then the Panini illusions right below it. I'm hoping to buy a Jumbo as soon as our equity loan comes through the house. So once I get that equity loan approved, then I'll be able to buy a box of Jumbo, hopefully. The prices are just insane. Alright, here we go. Let's see if we get anything. See all the hype is about these cards. Alright, here we got here Derek Favors. James Harden shoots what 75 uh, three pointers a game or something like that. Then we've got here Steve Adams, Malcolm Brogdon, Kevin Knox the second. And we have got here Tim Hardaway. This must be a, like a gold insert, I guess. It's a pretty card, though. Well, they are beautiful, though. Good looking cards there. And we've got JJ Reddick. Bismack Biombi. Now we've got here Bojan Bojanovic. Now we've got Naz Reed rookie card. And we've got Taco Fall rookie card. Yeah, I remember when they played Duke. No, uh, they just the refs basically. They gave Duke that game, Taco Fall. They um, 
They should have beat Duke. I forget who he played for. It was Central Florida, but I can't remember. But yeah, he's 7 5. And then we've got here Isaiah Roby, rookie. So yeah, these are very nice cards. I can see the appeal, but man, paying two and three times the amount. All right, let's get this one. See if we pull anything good. I don't know a lot about the cards. I know a few. My son keeps up with basketball pretty good, but I don't uh, keep up like I should. All right, here we go, guys. Robert Covington. Kyle Kuzma. Joe Embido. Joe Embid, I think. Brook Lopez. And we've got here Stephen Curry, Shining Star. That's a nice car to have. He's a heck of a three-pointer. Doesn't look numbered, but it, it's a pretty nice card, though. Panini loves their shiny cards. And this is Stephen Adams. Rudy Gobert, Joe Ingles, Ingles, and Harry Giles the third, and this is uh, rookie Nicolo Melli, and Carson Edwards. And then we got P.J. Washington, Jr. So, there we go, guys. The mystical cards that everyone is fighting for at Walmart. So, pretty neat. They are a nice-looking card, but I just don't know if they're worth the... the uh, the fight at Walmart are paying three or four times the price just to get a few rookies. So, Anyways, guys, I hope you all have a great weekend. Um, I hope you guys, um, hopefully you can find some cards out there. And hopefully your loans come through for anybody who wants to buy a hobby box or a jumbo box of these basketball ones. Hopefully you'll get a good interest rate. Anyways, have a great week next week, and I'll talk to you guys soon. And... Um, Hope you guys and kids are enjoying school and uh, give a like and uh, make leave a comment. Thank you guys. Bye.